All right, you guys. So listen, you all know I'm counting down to my birthday. So I love me some Brian McKnight, y'all. So anyway, I'm getting ready to go to Ollie's to see what they got good, to show you guys some new things, some good Christmas gifts ideas, show you some must-haves, see what they got new. So if that is something that interests you, keep on watching. All right, you guys. So I'm getting ready to go in here and see what we got, you guys. Right off the bat, those vacuum cleaners caught my eye because how about my vacuum cleaner is getting to its last leg. But anyhow, a lot of times when I come in Olives, I go, I head straight on over to the books, you guys. If you want a good read or anything like that, check out your local, local Ollie's. They have some time some of the best books and these were they were saying coffee table books but you can get them and then decorate them how you want it but if you love to read and you love to cook and all that they got different recipe books they have all types of stuff you guys valerie they she's a good one that book is a good one if you love to if you want to get into blending smoothies this is where you come to find some good recipe books and of course y'all know i told y'all in the last video i love puzzles so anytime i see puzzles i always go over to them it just helps me keep my mind growing and learning and y'all comment below if y'all remember these color books when y'all in sunday school when y'all were little they had the different numbers and you color the different numbers and then it'll be a picture when you get through with it i used to love those when i was a kid and so we strolling on through here, you guys. Like I said, I haven't been in Ollie's in months, probably since the beginning of the year. But yeah, I don't know what I was doing before I got a hold of the nacho shell tacos. But I can't eat my tacos without nacho shells. The regular shells is nasty. If your money is funny and you need to feed your family, Hamburger Helper will always get you right. That's one of our go-to in-house. If I don't feel like cooking a lot, that's a go-to in my house, honey. And then I headed on over here. And you, you have to really take your time over here because sometimes you find some hidden gems. Like this everything bagel, it tastes really good on avocado toast and your bagels, you guys. And the seasonings, their bottles in here are way bigger than Dollar Tree. And they're 97 cents, you guys. So if you need some seasoning, come to Ollie's. they 97 cents and they are a huge bottle. So you will get your bang, get your money's worth when you come in here for the seasoning and spices. So yeah, don't sleep on that section, you guys. You know the holidays are coming up. So, And then, of course, you know, they got different brands of detergent. They even got the bigger ones, you guys, over on another section. Um... They um have just a variety. Some of these brands I've never heard of them, but I always say detergent, liquid, liquid dishwasher is, um, dishwasher liquid is is all the same. But some of it is a little bit better than others. That Brillo now it doesn't work as good, but you know Dawn and all those, those are my go tos here. And sometimes I don't look at the detergent because sometimes they detergent be a little overpriced. I just have to keep looking and speak and span. I think I remember this when I used to work in a hotel as a um a, a maid. I used to clean with that speak and span. And this one is ten dollars and something in Target, so it was seven something in here. So if you want to try that TikTok hat, try it there first. And I thought that was pretty interesting. Some bees, they smell really good though. The apple cinnamon one for a dollar ninety nine, two bucks. Yeah, I'll try it out. And then I headed on over to the um, face wash and shampoo area. And that one by Neutrogena caught my eye. But like I said, I ain't going to do too much experimenting on my face because I'm trying to, my face is starting to get back to normal. So I'm not going to mess with that. And of course, I see this every year, you guys, soft soap, the, the starlight one. But it ain't my cup of tea. I, I like the peppermint one and I like my shea butter one. Those are my favorites. But, you know for a little couple bucks and i smelled that it didn't smell all that hot i love avocado but avocado lotion mm -mm. that yeah that put i put that right back on the shelf and then of course saint ives y'all know i raved about this in my big lots um um haul video so if you didn't see that video go back and watch that because i love saint ives uh body washes and this one Y'all, I had to pick this one up. I've been looking at this for months now. 
different people been talking about it. And I'm just curious to know what is shower jelly. Never heard of that before, but I'm going to try it out for a dollar and 49. Yeah. So that's what I said. And I, I just really was just browsing in here to see what goodies they have. Because like I said, I haven't been in here in months. And I saw this raw sugar mango hand soap by raw sugar. And raw sugar is a pretty good brand. So that pretty good because it's more than that in Walgreens. And of course, soft soap, my all-time favorite. Can't go wrong with that. I mean, they just had some really unique pieces. And I thought that I saw this and I was like, salt strub. I don't think I like salt scrub too much. They're a little too harsh for me, but this other one right beside it was snickle doodle. So I was curious, but let me tell y'all, let me put y'all something. It's going to get Christmas. You know, all the Christmas stuff is out. So wait to buy your fall stuff. Cause it's going to be marked down in the next few weeks because they got to put more emphasis on the Christmas stuff like now. So you, this is a good time to get your fall and summer stuff because of different series. Remember I said shop out of season, you guys. Like at the end of Christmas coming up into the new year is the perfect time to get your Christmas decor for next year. So it's all about knowing when the right times to shop, you guys. It is that time of the year. And like I said, these little gifts like this right here, they make the best stocking gifts, stocking stuffers. I mean, you don't have to break the bank, you guys, to get meaningful Christmas gifts. You just got to know the person that you love and know what he or she likes. And as far as Christmas paper, I thought this was a good deal. Four bucks for three bundles. Because like I said, the kid's just going to rip them up and tear it up. So spending all that money again on what? You're just paying for the name brand. So... I stopped that years ago when my kids was little. And like this right here, Kristen Tegan. I don't know if they still have her stuff in other stores on the shelf. Because I want to say this was the girl that had the controversy around her stuff. And they was taking her stuff off the shelf. But anyway, um, they have like different um, dish sets, little knickknacks and stuff. Like I needed some things to, you know how you tie your bags of chips, put those little clips on there to keep your chips from getting getting um stale cookies or whatever but yeah this is the section where you come and find little gadgets like that i thought that was really good and when my kids were little i used to make them popsicles like that all the time just i guess it was like going down memory lane this day because they have a lot of organizing stuff and speaking of that i need to clean out my refrigerator so that was the perfect reminder as you say. And for those of you that want to start juicing or smoothies, the Nutri Bullet is a great one. I had it years ago and I broke it. Well, it stopped working, but it's really good. And if you're in need of towels, remember I said every three to six months, switch out your towels because I mean, you wash your body for so long. But they were pretty good quality. They felt pretty good. So, yeah, if you're in need of some towels and just compare your prices. Like I said, some of them were overpriced. And I was like, yeah, you could set that down. But just compare your prices. Go and take your time and look around. And I promise you, this section right here, this section right here gave me so much life because I'm getting so excited when my hand gets back better. I can start back crocheting. But this gave me so much life. And again, you can buy Flip, I mean, slippers, fuzzy slippers. You can buy all these little things for great Christmas gifts. Yep. So, like I said, you just never know what you're going to find when you go into Ollie's. They have all kinds of stuff. Stuff that took me back to my childhood. Stuff for your feet. If you want to do a spa day, they have all kinds of stuff, you guys. Detox foot pad if you want to sit in the bed with your laptop or on the couch. All kind of little knickknacks. And this caught my eye. For my spa days, I'm looking forward to get one of these. It may not be in this store, but I'm getting me a facial steamer because it'll go good with my self-care days. So, yeah, just check your local Ollie's out. And this cute little fan, because y'all know I stay hot. So, I'm always needing a fan. And this one, for you guys that wear makeup, this little brush cleaner set, I thought that was really good. That'll make a good Christmas gift, you guys. And you don't even have to break the bank, you guys. And for all of you that love diaper cakes, this is the lighting box that I was talking about. It's the huge one, but... You can get it off of Amazon, but they had the smaller ones. So if you wanted to take pictures with your fav favors, that's what I was talking about, the lighting box. 
And as far as this right here, little brush sets and foot spas and all kinds of little knickknacks, clipper sets, you can buy meaningful gifts and still be within your budget and not break the bank. Nice little Christmas gift set ideas, you guys. I mean, clipper set, if you got a husband or a son in your life, a razor set, they they could use that. Especially like now when they can't get to the barber or anything. And don't sleep on your snack aisle, you guys. You find some of the best candy in Ollie's. They have some of the old-fashioned candy, you know, from back in my childhood. Um, like um, it's just, you just got to look. I mean, it's like you get up in there and you be like seeing stuff from your childhood. I don't know about y'all, but I go gooks. I go crazy when I see stuff from my childhood. I told you guys, fuzzy socks make the best Christmas gifts. Who doesn't love a pair of fuzzy socks? This took me back. My son loved him some Thomas and Friends when he was a kid. Oh my goodness. I Every time we saw Thomas and Friends, I would have to sit and watch it all day long. I mean, that just took me back for a moment there. These pork skins right here, I'm telling you, me and my dad, we love these things. I hadn't eaten them for about 10, 15 years and I got me a pack a year ago. And I stopped, y'all, I stopped in Kroger's. So this is Kroger's. But they had, y'all, when y'all go to y'all grocery stores, make sure y'all go to the hygiene section because they have some of the best deals sometime in the grocery store. That was like three bucks. I want to say it's three dollars and something at Walmart. And their Simple Truth brand, I'm going to try that. But y'all know how I feel about St. Ives and um soft soaps those are like two of my favorite body washes still have not yet to try native can y'all believe that and then of course they had the coconut and vitamin e um yeah they had all kinds of goodies you guys up in kroger's because i had to go go to go back to kroger's anyway to get a few things for dinner um tonight so I went back in there and I went to the hygiene section and they have some pretty good things in there, you guys. I mean, just check out this. Some of this stuff, I bet still want to try it, but y'all know how I'm stuck in my ways. I like what I like. And of course, they had some tree hut scrubs in there. One of my all-time favorites is the coconut and lime. That's my favorite. And then um, I've tried the watermelon one. I've tried the vitamin C one, but still coconut lime is my all-time favorite. So. And they had like cute little brand, like the Truth, the Simple and Truth brand. They had like shea butter. Um, they had like shea butter things. They had like bath bombs. I was like, look, look at this. They had like little body washes. This is where you could find some unique stuff. Like I, I thought this was so cute. The whip soap and scrub. I, I was like, you know what? I'm going to put that on my to-do list. I'm going to try that. And like if you want to find like some handmade soaps, look at this right here. I mean, you just never know what you're going to find in these grocery stores. And I thought, now that one, that scent right there, I didn't like that one. But that one, the mango one, that's good. But that Moroccan rose, oh, it stinks to me. But yeah, Epsom salt, all kind of goodies up in here, y'all. Go to y'all Kroger's and see what they got in there.
All right, you guys, so I am back from Ollie's. Actually, I went a couple of places, so um, I'm just gonna go in no particular order, but a lot of it, I had to get some groceries. So um, I got my son some Jello because he loves Jello. He did good on his science test, so I got him his favorite Sour Patch. Um, Y'all, let me just tell you, if y'all have not been making y'all tacos with these bold nacho cheese taco shells, I don't know what y'all been doing. It's like, I don't know what I was doing before this because it just takes your tacos to a whole other level. I can't even eat the regular taco shells, y'all, because it's just nasty. But the bold nacho ones, oh, <coughs> it's heaven. It's heaven. And then I wanted to get me something because y'all comment below and let me know if y'all like this. Y'all go in the store and buy for everybody else snacks and everything. And then when you get home, you be like, what did I buy myself again? So I made it a habit. I bought me some new cookies, butter pecan. They seem like they're going to be good because comment below if y'all grew up in a household where butter pecan was one of y'all top favorite ice creams. When I was a kid, my mom's favorite ice cream is butter pecan. It's an old brand, y'all, but... They got the butter pecan cookies. So, you know, I'm going to try them. I think the old I get, some of the stuff that I hated my mom doing, I be doing the same thing. I be like, really? Is there so really? So, got that. Um, got some more uh, butter. Laying a like honey butter spread. I love the butter spreads. Um, I got my Clean and Clear Kroger brand. Y'all know I had to go back to my old faithful. I love my CRV. The moisturizing, hydrating one, I use that at night. But it's keeping my skin from, you know how I tell you my skin used to always crack and stay dry? Since I've been using that hydrating moisture balance, CeraVe, I haven't been having any problems, but it's more moisturize, moisturizing and hydrating. So I wanted to get this to use in the morning to kind of make sure I clean, clean my skin. So got that. And while I was in Ollie's, because that's what we did a lot of today, shopped in Ollie's, I needed some storage bags. And these were two bucks. So I got 100 sandwich bags for my daughter. She takes her lunch to school. And then I wanted to try this Body Ecology Cleansing Shower Jelly. I don't know how it's going to feel, but I've always been wanting to try it. And it was $4.49. So I said I was going to try it. Um, bought me some chips. Um, got some juice. Um, got some shredded lettuce for cheeseburgers tonight because I text my kids and my son was like, you know, it, I don't care whatever I say y'all want to eat. I promise you, he going to say burgers every time. So I'm going to do what my mom used to do for us. I bought, well, let me just tell you this. How about your girl went in Kroger's and I got some sriracha chili sauce really good on your tacos, you guys. I got in Kroger and got everything and didn't even get the, 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 the key ingredient, which is the hamburger meat. I got to the car and was putting the bags up. I'm like, what the snap? I'm like, where the hamburger meat at? So good thing I hadn't left the parking lot because I had to go back and get some hamburger meat so I can make cheeseburgers tonight because how you, how you going to make some cheeseburgers and you ain't got no cheeseburger meat? I mean, we ain't meatless over here. You know, so I did that. I ran back in. Well, I ain't run. I, I just walked back on in there and got that. And then we're going to have some onion rings. Y'all know I had to call my mom. I was like, Mom, you know how you used to give us those treats every Friday night when we do good grades and all that? So I got two bags of onion rings. And I wanted to try this because the other one I tried, it was really good. So I got another, um, I got a different one. This is Spiced Apple Chop Kit with vinaigrette. Apple cider vinaigrette, so I wanted to try this salad, have it for like lunch and stuff. Um, got some shredded cheese because I got a little bit of tacos left, but going to do that, so I can't wait to do that because I love onion rings, you guys, and my kids love them too. So hopefully they'll want to watch a movie with mommy tonight, maybe. We'll see. We'll see. I'm pushing it. And then, of course, I had to take it back to, y'all remember when I was talking about the video before this? How my mom used to give us these big K. They used to be like 50 cent or a dollar back in the day. So I got this one and I got the peach. So that's going to be fun tonight, you guys. 
All right, and then like I said, I got the sriracha chili sauce. I couldn't find the one I wanted, so I got the Kroger brand. And then these are some of my other favorite smoothies. This is the one that I was talking about the other day. They were out of at Walmart. So I got this one. It's the peach parfait breakfast smoothie, my absolute favorite. Just got a few tomatoes. And then these biscuits right here are absolutely amazing. Put you a little butter and some syrup or honey inside of them. They are the bomb.com. They are the honey butter. They are so good. I've been eating these for years. And then, like I said, I got me some chips and had to get some more. Um, these, I'm telling you, the overnight ones are the absolute best with wings. Don't give me none that don't have no wings on them. I don't like them. All right, then I got some sweet Hawaiian extra large buns for the burgers tonight. And then while I'm on the subject, well, let me just finish the household stuff. Got more paper towels. There's nothing really to show there. But y'all, let me show y'all one of my early birthday gifts to myself. Y'all know I be talking about dossier. This one is floral. Let me take that light off. Okay, this one is floral lavender. And this is the dupe for Libre. And I took this in my purse today while I was out. Just so I can go in Sephora. What was this? No, I went in Dillard's and I smelled the Libre and then sprayed this. They smell just alike. When I tell you it's spot on, Dorcia, y'all did this. Because I've always been wanting to try Libre, but I just didn't want to pay Libre money. So I went on over to Old Faithful to Dossier and y'all already know how the little bottle is. Look how cute that is. So this is the dupe. And when I tell y'all, I got it on today. I'm just spray a little bit more on. Cause it smell good. This, this is what I'm wearing on my birthday night to dinner. This is what I'm wearing. Y'all pray for me that I don't get in no trouble. But this is what I'm wearing right here. Yes. Got my outfit ready. That's it. That's what I'm wearing. And then y'all know how I feel about Perfect by Marc Jacobs. One of my favorites. And it comes in a little box like this, you guys. And y'all know y'all can test it out. And if you don't like it, you can send the, the box back. It comes with the label inside of it that you can send it back. So you ain't even wasting no money. But this one is floral rhubarb. And y'all guess in the comments what this is the dupe for. Perfect by Marc Jacobs. When I tell y'all I was hurt, if y'all missed my empties from, from October, y'all know the products that I use, y'all know that Floor Rhubarb was one of them. And I got two, you guys. Y'all, I got two. Because I was like, I ain't running out no more. So, that's my early, one of my early birthday presents to myself. Y'all know I love smell good. So, I got two. So, I'm going to be, me and Perfect going to be real good together for, <coughs> oh, excuse me, for a long time, you guys. So, I had to get that. And I want to say, girl, I forgot how much it cost. Let me look on the receipt. I don't forget. Y'all, I be forgetting stuff. And they, they, they uh oh, they send you a return label. So, if you need to, girl, I don't know what the price of it is. I don't know. I, I put it up on the screen for y'all, but. This floor rhubarb is the dupe for Marc Jacobs. Y'all screenshot that. And right now they got, if you buy three, you get like 20% off. And then I had another 10% off because, you know, YouTubers that I watch that always talk about fragrance, they had a coupon code for that too. So I had two codes. So I got like 30 to 40% off. So, you know, I went complaining. You girl went mad. So, yes, when I tell y'all. It just smells so good. It just makes me happy. Y'all know fragrance makes me happy. Smell good. <coughs> this cold ain't cute. It ain't cute at all. But y'all, it smells so good. So if y'all be wanting to try something out, but y'all don't be wanting to try the money of it out, go to Dossier. I think I said that right. Go to Dossier, you guys, and try it out, you guys. I'm telling you guys. You will thank me later. Later. Do you hear me? It smells, that Libre dupe, it smells so good. Y'all, it smells so good. And then it comes with a little card, so it tells you the notes. And what Libre notes in there? I'm going to tell y'all what Libre notes are. Mattering, the top notes. 
um, middle notes, jasmine, lavender, orange blossom. I can smell that orange blossom. And then the base note is vanilla, amber, and mush. Y'all know that's why I love it. I knew it was, van I knew it was some vanilla in this because it's, it smells so good. Everywhere I went today, people was asking me like, oh, you smell so good. That, 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 that right there, that compliment has more weight to it than them saying I look good. I know I look good. I know I smell good. But when somebody say I smell good, I guess y'all have to know my story. Because it's, it's like I'm about to be 43. And honey, I got that scent thing down to a science. Now, you can't tell me nothing. Do you hear me? Oh, honey, when I get a compliment to say I smell good, it just, it lights my world up. And then, you know, it even, it, it, it makes it even better, you know, if he good looking, you know, good on the eye, like he, that eye candy. Mm. I may need to stop, stop, stop wearing this stuff because it's making me, um, I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know what the word is now. I don't even know what the language they use now. I guess I'm telling my age for real, but it's like, uh, it just makes me feel good inside. Oh, girl. Like, you walk by and you just leave that scent for them. <laughs> but anyway, so let me show you what I got from Bath and Body Works. I finally caught the sale, you guys. Buy one. Get, buy one. Lord Jesus. How we gonna do this? I guess I'll just, I don't know. Let me get up, y'all. Uh, they I had the coupon and it was a free full size. And this is winter peach marshmallow. I was like, come on, bath and body works. And I don't even do the lotion. I'll probably go back and get the spray. My baby probably gonna have this because she love she love lotion. See, I I'm not a lotion person, but I may just mix some of this in my bath, my my um body gel because that's what you do for bath and body work that's a tip for you guys when you buy lotion from bath and body work you know it don't last long to help it last longer mix it with some vaseline and some baby gel either one of those it'll it'll make the projection longer because when it has something to stick on to like your perfumes put your body gel or body or vaseline on first and then spray your post points and your your scent will last longer but this was my free gift so i got that and then they had, uh, let me just take my candles out, y'all. I don't want to break them because y'all know your girl will be over here crying. Uh, okay, now I can put this big bag somewhere. Woo! Woo, that takes a lot out of you, girl. But y'all know I always was talking about I haven't been in Bath and Body Works to get no candles because they don't never have no sale. Well, today I happened to go in there and they had to buy one, get one free. So that's like getting four candles for the price of two. So I bit the bullet and I got flannel. Y'all know I was talking about flannel a few videos ago. But it just, because see, I'm going to tell you, I, let me tell y'all this. And I, I'm, I'm going to be through. But listen, that baked vanilla, baked vanilla plug-in from Febreze. I got tired of it because every time I walked in, it kept, <coughs> it kept smelling like some baked cookies. See, at first I was happy about that. But when you hungry and you walk up in the house and you smell the baked cookies and you can't eat nothing because you got to cook, that made me mad. So I let it play it out. And then too, my son was getting mad. He was like, mama, that scent is it's just making me upset. I'm like, baby, what's wrong with Mama, it just smell, it's too fruity. It's too fruity. It's too sweet. But can you do something else? Like, can you go back to your old scent? I'd rather for you to do that than this, this too much. I said, okay, baby. See, that's what happens when you have a son or you have a husband in the house. You got to kind of, you got to kind of, got to go play around with scents and stuff. You can't have everything one way. You know, you can't, I can't have my way all the time. But that flannel, he liked that. And I like it too. Because it just smells Sometimes I be in the mood. I just want my masculine sense in the house. I just be in the mood. And flannel is really good, y'all. So I got flannel. And then I got one of my old favorites, Twisted pep Peppermint. When I tell y'all Twisted Peppermint smells really good, I like that in the melts. But I didn't get the melts this time. But I wanted to get the candles. So I used my 20% off um, on that. And then I got Mahogany 
teak wood. Hmm. <laughs> I bet your girl got two of these. <laughs> two. <laughs> yeah, it's lower. It gets lower. If you didn't say, you know, if I was a, you know, I had had in the little magic shows and they, they, they make a man come out the little magic show, like, come on, you weigh your little one. This is a man in a candle jar. It smells really good. I got my son a cologne and he sprayed it on when he went to his little dance. Yeah, I cried, y'all. I'm that mama. I cry over little bitty stuff. But to see my son just look really handsome and smell good, he went to his little dance and had a good time. That just made my heart so, so proud. But mahogany teak wood, y'all. If y'all haven't tried this candle, go get it. And go get flannel. Thank me later. I wanted to try some new candles because I always, every fall, I always do marshmallow pumpkin, vanilla marshmallow pumpkin. I always do that with every fall. That's like a theme in my house. No matter what, it, where I am in the fall, you you smell vanilla pumpkin marshmallow in my house. This year, you smell a little bit because I, <coughs> I want to try some new ones. And this is like mahogany teak wood and flannel is like one of my favorite fall scents now. Where it probably be year round. Because sometimes I just want to mix it up from my fruity stuff. Because I love my floors. I mean, not my floors. I love my fruity sweet scents. Y'all know that's that's me. But <clears throat> sometimes I want my home to just smell just clean, fresh. Smell like a man in here. You know, something like that. So, and then to my son be happy. So, I put flannel in his room or no, in his bathroom. And I put mahogany teak wood in the living room because... Y'all yeah, know when I get my candles, I'll be ready to clean, but it ain't happening today. It ain't happening today. Your girl tired. I got to go to work tomorrow. Yes, I work on Saturday. So, yeah, I got to go to work tomorrow. So, I'm probably going to feed some cheeseburger and onion rings and, and let the movie watch me. And, and I'm going to be in bed by 6.30, if not soon. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this little video, this little haul, this little these little jokes or whatever. I love you guys. Remember, hit that like button, you guys. Engage with this video. Share this comment. Subscribe if you have not already joined the family. Make sure you follow me over on Instagram because a lot of times I tell you guys when I get something um, before I even do the video. So, God bless, and I'll see you on the next video.